Hi, and welcome to another episode of the African Hair. Today we'll be looking at Yaya Adwa's handover note to Jonathan was hijacked. Brother, the younger brother to the late president, who is a serving senator for Castina Central at La Cisia Adwa, received this at the 12th year memorial event organized in his honor by the state government. The late president, Umar Musaya Adwa, has been said to have written a handover note for his vice president former president would love Jonathan while he was on a critical health condition but it ended up in Wong's hand. The younger brother to the late president who is a serving senator for Castilla Central, Abla Sisi Yadwa, received this at the 12th year memorial event organized in his honor by the state government. Senator Yadwa said when he was in Saudi Arabia during the critical moments of the late president, he had people complaining that his brother didn't hand over power. Adding that, I was disturbed that he left the country without handing over power, especially knowing the kind of person he was. When I inquired, I was told that he had written a note, but it wasn't sent to the right place. This was the reason they resolved to use doctrine of necessity at that time. Senator Yadwa added that the family at that time had been supportive even when the federal government delegation of some ministers and secretary of the government of the Federation was sent to assess the late president's situation on whether to use Section 144B of the Constitution to declare him incapacitated. He thanked the state government for organizing the event to reflect on the good deeds of the late Yadwa, which according to him had made a great impact on the state and the nation in general. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. See you on another episode of the African Age. Let's know your thoughts through the conversation. Thank you.